is the fluorescent top that I was sent by Aldi Special Buys and I'm going to show you the other stuff I was sent but then more importantly I'm going to show you the stuff that I bought in store today because you've got to get yourself to the Special Buys aisle of Aldi as it turned into cycling today and it's only there for a week and as they say when it's gone it's gone so um, I made sure I hot footed it there at 9 o'clock this morning because I wanted to have a look when everything was fully stocked and um, despite being sent a few bits by Aldi, I spent £90. So let me show you what I got. So this is what I got sent. Um, and I've seen this in store today. Um, you've already seen photos of this on my blog. This is um, the winter jacket. And like I told you on the blog, it's got three pockets at the rear and then an additional zipped one. I also got a cap that's called an under helmet cap. Um, I went there today to buy a helmet but I didn't see any helmets in the store. Um, I got leg warmers which I am yet to try and oh here they are leg warmers and they've got this elasticated bit that keeps them up and bib pants. These are like skiing salopettes. Um, I haven't been because I'm a little bit curvy and podgy I haven't been brave enough to wear these yet but already the weight is falling off from cycling so it'll only be a matter of time till I get these on but let me show you what I bought in store today so thanks to Monica from mum mum on the brink um, she told me to get the merino stuff so I did because I'm open to suggestion like that so I got the base layer you can see it's got a wool content and crane I think is Aldi's own brand so yeah it's got wool in it merino base layer long sleeve top and I got it in a ladies large. On the back it says that large is size 6 to 18 which is me. I am perfectly between 16 and 18 and like it says breathable, comfortable, cooler in summer, warmer in winter which is incidentally what Monica told me on Twitter so yeah I got the top and I got the trousers but I had to rummage a lot. Everything was tidy and really full but I had to rummage a lot to find the trousers they were quite low down. Um, so yeah, large long johns and large top. This is what I actually went for, which is the front and the rear lights. Now, when you look at it, you think that's a rear light and a torch, because it looks like a torch. But if you read it, it says that the white light has three functions. So one of those functions is obviously to be as a torch, especially as it's got a wristband attached. But yeah, and what I love is the batteries are included. So, of course, I didn't just get lights for me, I got them for Aaron too, because the morning soon enough will be dark. Um, I know that it's not going to take long, so my hands are going to be cold holding those, um, what do you call it, <laughs> handlebars, whatever. So I got myself gloves. They didn't have any children's cycling stuff, so just for me, not for Aaron. Um, but I got them in a large, and yeah, breathable, waterproof, windproof. Um, I also got helmet covers, um, I've never heard of those before, but um, I do plan on getting a helmet, Aaron's already got one, so um, so yeah, I got those, I've got a sneaky bag of sweets, um, oh, I fell in love with these socks, ergonomic cycling socks, can you read what that says, highly flexible comfort cuff, two side protection, three toe protection, for flexible Achilles tendon protection, ooh, instep protection, heel protection. Mm, they sound great. So I got them. I also got very tempted by the heart rate monitor, more for the fact that I desperately need a watch, and because I'm obsessed with not being late for school, you can't get your... I, I look a little bit silly on a bike because I have my handbag. <laughs> um, I'm not like your professional cyclist. So, um, yeah, I have a handbag, and... Um, my mobile phone's in there and the only way I can check what time it is is with my mobile and I can't when I'm cycling along keeping an eye on myself and keeping an eye on Aaron I can't keep getting the mobile out to check the time so I got this mainly um, for the fact that it's a watch as well as a heart rate monitor but as I get fitter no doubt I'll use it for that as well um, and I got these reflective bands there's four so um, maybe I can have two on my arms and two on Aaron's arms or Maybe he can have all of them or, I mean, if I'm wearing this high-vis top, then maybe he can have two on his arms and two on his legs, but I'm sure we'll find a use for them. And what I really loved was um, these spoke reflectors. I'm going to put them 
on Aaron's bike because if his bike looks like that he's just gonna love it um, and hopefully it will make him more visible to cars because that really is the end goal isn't it being high vis to stop us getting hit you want to know how much those things were right so this is the special buys brochure that you can get in store and um, when I picked this up it was advertising the cycling event for this Thursday and as you can see the um, orange jacket that I'm modelling in my blog post is $16.99 and there's lots of other bits and pieces. The merino base layer, the top is $15.99 and the bottoms are $15.99 so that's why I easily spent $90 because the $15.99 is each um, but Monica from Mum on the Brink assures me that is cheap for merino wool mix. Um, the bright top that features in my blog post is only $9.99 and I'm wearing it right now and it is really snug and lovely. And the bike lights that I got for me and Erin, you get the red and the white one together in a pack for just $6.99 which I think is really good. And um, those lovely spoke reflectors that I got are only $4.99. Um, oh, and I got two of these helmet covers um, which are $4.99 each. What else did I get? Oh, those leg warmers that they sent me um, as press samples, they're $7.99. I couldn't get the shoes because they're in sizes 8 to 10 and I'm a size 6, but they're $19.99. But yeah, there is... Oh, and there's the gloves. They don't look like the gloves that I got though, but I think the gloves I got were $7.99. I haven't been brave enough to wear the bib pants yet, but I was sent those. Wow, they're $29.99. I'm going to have to get them on. I don't feel quite slim enough to wear them yet, though. But, yeah, there is lots of proper professional cycling stuff in the store. So um, it will be there for approximately a week. But when it's gone, once they're gone, they're gone. So get yourself there as soon as possible. The stuff went in store today, so I was there at 9 o'clock this morning. <laughs> 